Hamlin. I'm Taylor. And I'm Carly, and we're the Chief Residents of Diagnostic Radiology at UAB. We'd like to take this opportunity to welcome you and say thank you for coming to check out our program today. As the Chief Residents, we're always available if you have any questions, and you can also check us out on social media. To help you guys get a better feel for our program, we've invited a group of residents to come chat with you all about what we think makes Birmingham and UAB so special. We hope you enjoy. For me, UAB, I think, checked all the boxes that I wanted in a residency program. I thought it was a very well-rounded program. I didn't see any major weaknesses at UAB. I think it left every single door open um, with any sort of career path that I could possibly want. Being at a tertiary center affords you, as a radiology resident, experience with a vast range of pathologies. So as a tertiary center, you're going to get a lot of trauma. So that's important. You're also going to see a lot of uh, other disease processes that maybe smaller community hospitals don't have experience with. Repetition breeds expertise as a radiology resident. And so being at a tertiary center affords you that repetition so that when you get out in the community and practicing, you are an expert. So one of the exciting things about interventional radiology here is that as a resident, you're assigned to a room and whatever case is assigned to your room is your responsibility. So you get a sense that you're really helping run the service by running a room, seeing the patients going in and out of the room, and if you get a really complex, interesting case in your room, that's your case to do, and that's regardless of your PGY status. So even as a lower level resident, uh, you'll be participating in complex procedures with attendings. So your exposure to procedures, um, I felt was really high, um, even as an early resident. So now being a fourth year and having completed the core and having that behind me, it's not really until now that I'm fully appreciating all of the breadth of pathology that we see at UAB and how that has done such a great job in preparing me for not only for that test, but for my life as a radiologist. I think for me, the reason I ended up choosing UAB um, as the place to train for my residency is because at this program, you really get the best of both worlds. You get the high-powered academic center where you're working alongside attendings who are committed to being a part of the conversation for advancing the field of radiology. But at the same time, you get a very personable uh, work environment that's very nurturing, and I realized that that's the place I wanted to train. I feel like the curriculum at UAB very well prepares us for our next steps. We have residents that really go into every field following training, and I think that's a testament to that, um, that you get training a great foundation to do whatever you want. One of the great things about our curriculum is that it's very conducive to maximizing our learning. Um, so we'll alternate different subspecialties and different modalities within those subspecialties throughout our years of training. Um, and this is amenable to our call schedule, since we're taking call all throughout our second and third year and also um, conducive to learning the things we need to know for our core exam. So coming in as a first year, the learning curve in radiology is very daunting. And so there's time set aside each week for us on Wednesday afternoons to where all the first years gather. And we have different departments and specialties, whether that's physics to IR to nuclear medicine, come and give us specifically geared first year lectures. And that has been so valuable um, just to kind of get a lay of the land, but also to start building up that knowledge base. It's very evident that the attendings like to teach because even when it gets sometimes a little busier, the list is piling up, there are more procedures to do, the attendings don't let that take away from the fact that they're going to sit down with you, they're going to teach you, they're going to show you these interesting cases, even if it means they're going to be leaving later in the day. They really take every opportunity to, to teach and to make sure that um, by the end of the day we've gained something um, through working with them. I think call is honestly like where I've learned to become a radiologist. Our call experience is just phenomenal. Um, the volume is high, but not undoable, and you always have lots of help. We always have at least two and often three residents on call um, at one time, which is great because we bounce things off of each other. If something looks funny, I'm always like, hey, can you come here and look at this? Or um, it's a lot of great opportunity for teaching between residents to residents, so if you have a fourth year on with the first year and there's like I'm always be like oh look at this this is interesting you might not have seen this before so um, there's just like so much growing that comes with your time on call and it's actually just been very enjoyable and it's like what has made me become a radiologist. UAB is a great place to do research. 
speaking broadly in both the diagnostic and interventional radiology sections, there are copious opportunities for research. We have many attendings engaged in many different types of research, and they are very good at making us all aware of what they're doing and giving us the opportunity to volunteer and help out. So I think one thing that UAB Radiology does really well is support and that's support in many different ways. Um, academically, they support us and they're guiding us and they're mentoring us each step of the way. Um, they also support us financially. I would say that most residents in our program are able to buy a home um, if that's something they're interested in. Uh, I did, I know that for sure. Um, the last thing would be uh, support in terms of the faculty and the resources they give us. Um, they want us to succeed, they want us to do the best we can, and, and they really back that up with what they say and what they do and how they structure it. We're put at a level, I think, in terms of workload, which is kind of optimal because the, you know we, we work hard and we, and, we, and we see you know a lot of stuff which is what you want as a resident um, but you're not put in a situation where you're you feel like you're being overworked and you're um, just kind of beat down so you, you really kind of get that mix I think at UAB where you're you're trained well but you're not you know burned out hopefully so um, I think that's that's a good you know some, something the program has done a good job of finding you know striking a balance. I think it was really important to me to find a program that had women in leadership, um, especially in radiology. So I think during the interview process, there's opportunities to speak to residents, to faculty members who are also leaders and experts in their um, respective fields. While getting to know them, I realized that UAB had a chance for me to get mentorship, um, also find out guidance with pursuing different parts of radiology. So I think a great thing about UAB is that we have a community of women who want to teach you, um, give you guidance and mentorship to pursue your goals. So for me, it's been all about the people um, from day one, whether that is from our absolutely phenomenal program director, Jessica Zarzor, um, through all of our wonderful attendings uh, that we get to see and work with every day. Uh, but most importantly, uh, my co-residents and the, the incredible friends that I've made uh, over the course of the, the last four years. So my interview process was a little different at UAB than most other people's because I got sick and like immediately everybody came to like help me and offer me different ways to interview and get through the process and they were all just like so kind and as soon as I stepped foot on campus I just like knew that this was home.